Wake up, wake up, wake up. It's the Mecca Media Morning Show, and I'm none other than Ms. Persley. You already know. Brother Hiram, tell me something good. What up, Pers? Hey. What's going on, Miss Lady? You know, cannot complain. Hey, man, listen, man. You, you the lady in the red dress today. You know, well, thank you. You looking beautiful. Thank you, thank you. I listen, appreciate it. And you also got, like, this golden... Egyptian statue pit. Okay, one. you know, just shout out to Joe Scott. I'm just trying to live my life like it's golden. Hey man, oh, man. And you're witty. You know, I try. I try. That's what's up. <laughs> Brother Hiram, why don't you go ahead and hit him with the inspiration of the day? We definitely need it. Real worship is rooted in the word. Mm, hit him with that one more time. Real worship is deeply rooted in the word. Okay, real worship is rooted in the word. And so I just, you know, we have to go back to Genesis. In the beginning, there was the word and the word was God, right? So if you're really worshiping God and you're trying to follow um, and, you know, just kind of grow your life, not even just kind of, definitely grow your life, um, you want to study. And this is how you worship because getting that information helps you to walk better in your day-to-day -day life. They say that King David was a man after God's own heart and it was because of the amount that he studied and how much he was in the word and trying to gain that extra godly knowledge so that he could apply it and be better. So, and that is that. That's all I have to say about that. So now that we have finished up with the inspiration of the day, it is time to hit him with the information of the day. And as you know, we get all of our information from the reporter newspaper online.com. So pull up your smartphones or go to your computers and it works on Android, iPhone, doesn't matter. We are friendly. So go to your internet and you want to type in www.thereporternewspaperonline.com and you're going to, so my phone is set up to be like a web page because I'm a cheater. But if you have it set up to be a mobile device, there's going to be a three bar line. You'll click that and you want to go to entertainment. Other than that, you'll click the entertainment at the very top and it'll take you right to the page. Cheater, you're the cheater. I am a cheater. Okay, it's all right then. But if you go to your web options, you too can have all of your stuff on your mobile phone show up like it does on a computer, which I like better because I'm a nerd. <laughs> so the topic I'm talking about is Faith Evans, singer arrested for domestic violence after fight with husband Stevie J. Wait a minute, whoa, 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 whoa. Are you telling me Faith Evans was, she got arrested for fighting Stevie J? I tell you why there's no love. You mean from, um, Loving hip hop, Stevie J. Yes, Stevie J. Married. Married. That's real. Them's murdered. They be yes, that is for real. They are murdered, um, and it's official. She has her wedding ring and all of that. They've actually been on Love and Hip Hop together, and like it's it's an official wedding, but like an official marriage rather. Uh, so law enforcement sources tell TMZ. Faith was arrested earlier this week around uh, 1 a.m. after cops got called to their L.A. area home. We're told that Faith and CV got into a heated argument and at some point it turned violent. Um, our sources say that when cops showed up, they noticed visible marks and scratches on Stevie's face. It's unclear what triggered the argument, but in any event, cops arrested Faith and booked her for felony domestic violence and Faith did bond out later that day. Mm. Mm. I wonder if she's gonna be like, Stevie, Stevie, give me one more chance. Oh. <laughs> I but listen, that's just a piece of the article. Make sure you go into the reporter newspaper online.com to read the article in full detail. Cause that's pretty interesting. A little juicy. I like that. So now that we finished up with the information of the day, I'm gonna tell you guys about the black business of the day. How about I'm gonna give you the black daughter? Oh, why do I always? That's all right. I'm so sorry. Right. I'm so excited. Listen, I'm so excited about the black business of the day. I'm always giving over. But yes, we definitely need that black thought of the day. Well, check this out, the black thought of the day which is the most important part of the day. Muy importante. Speaking about all this um, turmoil that we're going through here in North America right now. So um, how about this? I'm, I'm just gonna yes. say this. I'm gonna say, every now and then, you may see this flag that you see to your left. That mm. is the red, black, and green flag. Mm. A lot of us don't know what it represents, but it represents a united are you uh, uh, Africans united no matter where you at in the diaspora or on the continent if you have African descent yes. the flag represent that unity across the uh, uh, whole community okay Back. this is what I want you guys to know what do the red the green and the black stand for mm -hmm. the red black and green the red stands for the blood the green stands for the land 
The black stands for the man. Y'all better feel me before they kill me. Red, black, and green, you know what I mean? You better say it. All right. I'm so, thank you so much for that black thought of the day, Brother Hiram, because I think a lot of people don't know what the red, black, and the green stand for in our flag, and that was stuff, that's facts. So, you gotta know it. Look it up, man. It's, we, we are amazing. Melanated magic, facts. So now that I was so overly excited to announce the Black Business of the Day, we bring you Overstreet Travel Salon. This is Natasha Overstreet. She is an amazing, amazing woman, super educated, super talented, and very, very skilled when it comes to doing hair. But it is a online beauty supply store. There's over 4,000 items. If you're still rocking the weave, they got it. You need some natural oils for your fro to make it glow, they got it. So this is what you do. Make sure you go to Natasha, to Overstreet Travel Salon. So it shouts out to Natasha Overstreet as being the CEO and founder of that. So. Thank you all for waking up with the Mecca Media Morning Show. I'm your host, Ms. Persley. Brother Hiram, thank you for laying all that blessed knowledge onto our mentals. We definitely need that. I hope that everybody has ha definitely downloaded Angel Food Cake because it's out there. Shouts out to BAM 330, People's 330. And if nothing else, make sure you're coming out to support the ABLE balloon release that's coming up in June. Hit me up for tickets. They're still available. Peace.